pressure is mounting on Saudi Arabia. Britain, France and Germany have issued a joint statement saying they are treating the incident with the utmost seriousness. They have asked the Saudi government to provide a detailed response to questions over Khashoggi's disappearance, saying those responsible must be held to account. We are all extremely concerned uh, about the stories that have emerged and the country that can help us get to the bottom of this is Saudi Arabia. So what happens from now on is absolutely up to Saudi Arabia. President Donald Trump has said he will punish Saudi Arabia if it's found to have killed Khashoggi. And some American lawmakers say they are prepared to act. So I will just say this to you with full confidence. If this is proven to be true, there is going to be a response from Congress. It's going to be nearly unanimous. It's going to be swift. And it's going to go pretty far. And that could include arms sales, but it could include a bunch of other things as well. Those threats led to $33 billion being wiped off the value of Saudi's stock market on Sunday, its worst fall in years. But the world's biggest oil exporter says it will retaliate if any sanctions are imposed. The kingdom affirms its total rejection of any threats and attempts to undermine it, whether through economic sanctions, political pressure or repeating false accusations. That will not undermine the kingdom, its steadfast position and its Arab, Islamic and international status. A critic of Saudi's war in Yemen, Khashoggi vanished after entering the consulate in Istanbul on October 2nd. Turkish investigators say local staff working at the consulate told them on the day of his disappearance they were asked to leave because a diplomatic meeting was taking place. Despite Riyadh agreeing to cooperate with investigators, they say they still haven't been granted access to the building, and that's fueled speculation. In the last two days, much evidence has been collected. Some of the rooms in the consulate building and the consul's own house have been renovated. Just two days after this incident, the walls were painted. So international pressure against Saudi Arabia is growing, but so far there is no sign Riyadh is willing to let Turkish officials into the consulate to conduct an investigation. Caitlin McGee, Tiati World, Istanbul.